Words, children. Words. I'm not fucking done recording this game now. Not yet. But, but since we're using fraps... Let, let's go ahead and see an unclipped version of the intro. Might as well, right kids? Oh my gosh! Is that, is that like, near-perfect emulation? Or the sound doesn't clip at all? Sacrifices are made, children. It things wonderful and convenient for me, and pretty in windowed mode. But why not? Why not do this? Volume warning, kids! I'm about to crank this shit up! Okay, I blame that on my computer. Fraps and that and everything. My my laptop just couldn't handle all that epicness together. Let's crank the music back down. There we go. All right. Key set slightly different in this because uh, EPSXE does not like setting the start button or anything to uh, enter. So I had to put start backspace. I haven't actually tested this out. The, we're, you're just going to come along with me. We'll test this out together, everybody. Yay! Hmm. Hope this works out. See Huo Jun, which is cool, I guess. And you get to see the loading screen. Isn't that awesome, everybody? Load was complete. Okay, that's us. That's good. I saved it right before I ended turn. So let's go ahead and end the turn thing. I don't think a fast forward key exists in EPSXE, so I won't be able to blow by any of the emissary action. Although I can have the game skip it entirely. My lord, preparations for the attack on Zhilang have been completed. The enemy is not yet aware of us. Let's go right up to the castle gates. Awesome. There'll, there'll, there'll be a little bit of lag in terms of sound, I believe, and issues simply because I'm recording this with fraps and emulating games while recording with fraps. My computer's not that good out. So let's take a look at what we have here. A very scattered army. Uh, it's not quite the information I wanted. This will work, though. So what are we facing here in terms of the enemy here? We're facing five units. Not that many troops compared to what we have. That's 8,000... 108,000? No, it's 10,800. I forgot the button which allows me to view that stuff. Oh, okay. <laughs> 9,800, my bad. Morale is 80. Food is higher than mine, understandably so. They have one more unit than I do. This cavalry unit will likely come try to sabotage my supply tent. Now, I'm going to have a difficulty assailing multiple gates in this situation because of this mountainous terrain here, but I reckon it is possible and feasible, and we are certainly going to try. Master Reaper, your orders. Fierce speed. Tramp search is pivotal right now. Um, go ahead. You will capture enemy commander, but first off, your objective is to destroy this gate. You should be able to get through that mountainous area right there just fine. And actually, I'm going to send everybody over there to destroy that gate. Policies, capture commander, gate. I can have somebody try to, I could have the advisor try to give fake orders to that unit so that maybe he can't escape back into the castle, but I think maybe he might be trying to destroy my, my food tent or capture that. So I'm just going to leave things the way they are. You do that. This will be a short video. I'm just going to resolve this battle, and then I'm going to conclude the video just to see how everything worked out. All the settings and situations, and what's the Baba do dad to jigger boo boo thingies. If I need to adjust volume on anything, or whether we'll be good to go. 
He'll be fine. Right, my... That's my start button, I forgot. Check to make sure all my settings are set. Good. You, Zay Gorky, once again, your objective is to guard the supply tent with your life. Do not lose this, or I will kill you. <laughs> True story. We are good to go. Orders have been issued. Let us proceed. Yep, he's going after the supply tent. And my units are going after the gate. I found a trap! Sweet. Good thing I wasn't able to step that way then in order to get to that gate I wanted to destroy, or else that could have been bad. Been waiting for this moment. Everybody, light the flames! That was the worst attempt to set my supply tent on fire I've ever seen. A troop of a few hundred volunteers have joined. Dick. Okay, so this will work. Hey, get off the water! This will be fine, then. I can just order them to destroy this gate. We're right next to it. Everything's good. Order. Change mine. Destroy gate. Here. That'll be good. Your orders now, instead, are to send fake orders to, say, this unit. Monty's in the castle. I'm aware. Still give it a try. You will... You'll be fine for another set. I'm just gonna leave you there to guard that. Just in case he decides to send out the other horse unit to sabotage that as well, you'll be there to defend it. Gate, you will destroy this gate, Zal Bucket. Don't let me down. Uh, Metazeeg, once again, gate attack right here. Good to get him drops. Let us proceed. I've been waiting for this moment. Everyone, light the flames. Once again, you failed train. But you escaped into the castle. Okay. Have fun sitting there, Zay Gorky. Now, of course, all of his infantry, like his main commander unit, is like, Oh, shit. I've been fucking tricked. Yeah, that's Matang. That's the main unit right there. No, we weren't properly prepared. We didn't issue the right orders. And, of course, he's shooting arrows, pew, pew. But it's like, oh, shit, it's too late. Commands retreat. Then commands a charge. Just which is which. That's right. Pac-Man Shanks sent you conflicting orders through the castle. How badass is that, kids? How badass is that? Yeah, the gate's been open! Our next target is the commander's head. But there he is. Okay. Who gets to stop this? Zal Bucket and Metazeeg, you are temporarily stepping away. I hate it whenever units are stacked, because I had to deal with additional screens. Wait. You move there. No. I'm not. Quit. Arrow type would be normal, that's fine. Metazee, your objective is to move to this spot. No, I'm not indicating that. So you too can shoot the enemies with arrows. Say, Gorky, that's enough defending that. It's time for you to get in on the action, world class sprinter. You too shall move here. I'm not indicating a position on top of the wall, and then you will wait for my next command. Let's do this shit. Master Reaper's objective is to try and execute a duel, because he's a badass. So he will slowly eat, array, uh, eat away at the morale of my foe. Maybe I get lucky and uh, sway him into a duel, I don't know. So let's go ahead and move. Stop Metazeeg's troops, let's go! And they, they do the little delay thing. I'm not sure why they do that whenever you open the castle gate. I guess to try to delay you to get to the commander or the castle itself. Regardless, it's being done. Metazeeg refused to be held up there. Whatever. So Master Reaper is handling the brunt of this assault himself while everyone else is in the background shooting arrows at our foes to quickly annihilate their troops. Okay, we've arrived. Ah, oh, shit! I forgot to alter Metasieg's orders, his policy. Now he's about to move back. Yes, yes. That's lovely. Rainbow Kitten. So yeah, Metasieg is back now. That's that's great. It's not what, what I meant to have happen, but it happened all the same. I can always have Metasiga pursue um, 
that guy I'm confusing and try to have a duel with him. That could be cool to see. I don't want a Master Reaper to go pursuing that. I want him to focus solely on Ma Tang, and I can't send conflicting orders to the enemy commander. That's how it works, kids. I think a unit's about to be destroyed there. Okay, Metasig. You have a good VAR. Your war rating is not that high compared to what everybody else is. Uh, you guys are pretty much out of troops. Still, we might be able to squeeze in a good war here. Go ahead and pursue and duel him, and then you attack the enemy commander. Sweet, he's confused. Oh, they tried to send him conflicting orders. That's nice. Yes, once again, you're all trying to stop him, and you're just a bunch of kids. Unit has been destroyed. Where are you, Martin? Come out and fight me. Marty, come fight with me. Yes! Metasig has forced a duel. Here's a duel, everybody. I know XSI is constantly harping about it. I want to see a duel. So, arrow, and then we're going to use the capture technique. The body of both fighters affects this outcome and is made ineffective by special moves. Hopefully, I'll be able to end that one quickly. I don't have any other moves to use after that, so... There you go. Strong policy. I don't want to go completely suicidal. Let's see what happens. I have a distinct war advantage here. I will fight you. Take this. I was hoping it wouldn't be you, but it can't be helped. Can you evade my arrow? What you- Oh shit, he did! Damn! Nice job. Metasig, you failed me at everything forever. I'm gonna knock you out that horse of yours. Oh well. It doesn't appear Monty actually has any uh, tactics though, so that'll be okay. Oh no! Oh! Oh, Metasig, you failed me. That, that is unfortuitous. I'm disappointed in you. It's not my fault I executed those tactics perfectly. You couldn't hit him with an arrow, and he didn't have any specials. He didn't try to dodge it, he just failed on your roll miserably. The capture one, I can excuse that, but I thought the arrow would hit, so I thought, uh, Mati's, uh, Mati, with the power of heart, <laughs> I thought his, I thought his body would be lower, and it wasn't. I'm very disappointed now. The bright side, we will, uh, capture this castle. Yes, yes. Yes, yes, it's nice. Today we'll be retired, blah, 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 blah. Oh yeah, we're pursuing the fleeing enemy. He doesn't have many troops to stop me here. So we can capture forces. Unfortunately, Montang managed to get back into the castle, so he may actually get away from us. But I hope not. <laughs> Your soul is mine. Must decide the fate of the prisoners of war. Would you like to join me? I am funny, you're right. Welcome to jail. Would you like to join me, Marty? Nope. You two get to go in jail, you little coward. Thank you. Okay. Hansui? Yeah. It is the fate of the loser. Lang Liang Zing? Nah. Sweet! And since there's still a city left in his empire, I cannot try to recruit him. You can't really imprison rulers, so I can either release or kill him. And I'm gonna go ahead and release him. So I'm not even worth killing, am I? Wan Xiao, meanwhile, has attacked Ye in an attempt to retrieve it. The forces of chaos, doom, and despair. Oh, you finished your search. So have you. Didn't really find anything useful. Are you guys going to get recruited away? Nope. Cool beans. Cool beans. So what is our casualty report there? Soldiers that we have left. We lost a few men. But with another city, we can uh, draft those guys back next month whenever we get some more gold at our disposal. We are also able to recruit horses here. This is a level 2 city. 
Wunderbar, everyone. Wunderbar. It takes care of this episode. I'm done. Piff, poff, and twaddle. You'll also notice my prestige rating went up by one. That's because I released Ma Tang. Had I executed him, I would have lost a point. I think you lose one prestige for every officer you execute. Whereas releasing them straight up without asking them to join you first gets you one prestige point. I couldn't ask Ma Tang to join, so there you go. There's that. So we're slightly more prestigious now. Not terribly so, but slightly more. Next time on Let's Get All That Romance of the Three Kingdoms 6, presuming this episode worked out well. Yeah. Who knows? I'm going to go ahead and save the game before I forget of a mysterious JG incident where I'm going to have to redo that battle. I'll even save on camera. Because I'm kooky. Save here in the mace lot. Maybe Sun, son of Sun He and the last Emperor of Wu. For attaining the throne, he is thought to have great ability. However, his cruel and wasteful actions after he ascends the throne soon lose him the popular support. He's attacked by Jin and surrenders. Jin, by the way, is uh, the name that Wei is given after the Sima clan takes it over. We're done here, kids. Nothing more to see. Doodaloo.